Okay, guys and gals, welcome back to Surviving Bedrock. We are back over here at the main base because we are going to finally tackle that nether fortress. We had to uh, put it on pause slightly because we had a an extra plan for it. So we are going to head into the nether right now. And we've got some um, iron and I got my anvil because I'm going to... I already repaired my boots. We're going to repair our um, chest plate and our leggings just to make sure we're going in with full durability on our gear because I don't know what we're going to run into in there. But since I don't have mending on these yet, we can buy it from our villager. But I just... We're probably going to just upgrade to diamond. So we're just going to do this really quick and spend the levels just to repair this stuff. So I want to make sure we're going in there with full durability. And I don't know where my iron helmet is. Is it in here somewhere? It might already be in the nether. That's my backup gear. I think it's already in the nether. So we're just going to go into the nether. And we're going to start this off. And as you guys can see, the whole reason that we held off on doing the Nether Fortress, because we're going to do it together with Sammy, because she needs to do another fortress as well. And the one I kind of picked is kind of in between the two of us. So it seemed like a good project to tackle. OK, so here's where I left my iron helmet. We're going to grab that and we are going to grab these as well. We spent some time making up these swords so that we can get a Smite 5 Diamond Sword, because that will do enough damage to one-hit the Wither Skeletons. So we are going to spend an awful lot of levels combining these. Did I have a book too? I did. That was what I was going to do. Those are going to be a lot of levels, but that's a pretty good sword, minus not having Fire Aspect which isn't really going to matter too much for what we're doing, because most of the mobs you'll find in the other fortress cannot be burned. Fix that. Okay. Are you ready to run down the hallway? I am ready. <laughs> All right. I've got some stuff thrown in this chest right here for being able to whip up some potions. Once we get... I do have some blaze rods, because I did kill a couple blaze already but i hadn't made up the potions What's yet over there that is a long even longer tunnel than the one we just took that is another fortress oh. and eventually it'll go to another fortress and then eventually it'll go to a treasure bash and then i'm going to uncover oh wow <laughs> yeah so that's a that's a long tunnel i dug because of me digging this tunnel down here, that was why mm -hmm. when we're done with this fortress down here, I was going to leave this fortress to be yours to like oh, okay. make a blaze farm or a fortress farm out of, since this is the closest one to your area. And then I will be migrating down to that one, which is like Z900. Oh, wow. That's crazy. It's got a really cool <laughs> blaze spawner set up over there. They're not. There's two of them. They're just like three blocks too far away to be linked together. It's horrible. <laughs> mm, to go and raid the fortress. I am going to just run the fortress as a time lapse so you can watch all the fun shenanigans. And if we die, please keep count because I might forget. Let's hope we don't die. <laughs> um. I don't have blocks. Oh yeah, um, I got a solution for that. Come down here, right there. Okay, I'm like, oh crap, we need to have some blocks. As I was digging this tunnel out, every hundred uh -huh. blocks, I put a barrel and dumped all my netherrack in it. Oh, that is a... I was going to put like a door or something. That's just like a, an access oh. to the top. It's literally right into the fortress. Oh, yeah. I dug this right into the fortress. <laughs> I haven't done anything other than this. This is where I ended when I was doing the last episode. Oh, blaze. Ooh, diamond and horse armor. Ooh, go for it. 
I don't want to get shot with the blaze. Okay, you want me to bow him? Oh gosh, there's weather. Scully thing. Got him. Um, this fortress is pretty safe because it's mostly underground. The other one I'm going to tackle, it's like all open and above lava lakes. Kind of scary. That's, uh, I'm going to lure these guys over to us. Hey guys, come on. Okay. Sammy's they quick all... Sammy's quick on the pillars. The cheaty bars, uh, as we yeah. like to call them. So I now my do. sword should, yep, oh. one, one hit them. Well, yep, I'll let you take care of them. That's why I went for the smite five on the diamond sword. And yeah, we'll no, just get I, rid of you. I have to do these little Hi, buddy. cheaty bars. Oh yeah, absolutely. Anybody they... tackling another fortress should definitely put these up at like every intersection and at different lengths throughout. That way you don't go around a corner and catch a wither skeleton in the face. <laughs> and I, I do like I'm I don't care. It also helps me um, when I do a fortress. Um, so there's going to be another war down here, Agro. Yeah, I know. We have to kind of okay. dig because it's Ooh, got a weird there's um, lava. There's lava down here spilling into it. Uh, yeah, there is. Um, okay, okay. we're going to have to quickly like place blocks on this lava before it burns this. Let me Oops. see if I can do it quick enough. I didn't. Okay. I did not do it. I saved I saved here. this side. Okay. But we have some nether I don't think I've ever seen lava in um, the nether like this. We'll just grab stuff for now and we will divvy up the yeah. loot after the fact. I've yeah. seen some interesting lava booms in places before. Really? I, I guess oh. we could probably take the soul soil, huh? I am. I always do. I have a whole bunch of it from digging out the tunnels already. I will oh, take really? these magma blocks, though. I have so many if you need any. Oh, here, I'll let you take all the soul sand. Or I said soil oh. soil, it's soul sand. I threw some on the okay. ground there for you. Okay, these I guys are kosher it. with me. Let's do this. Um, that leads to nowhere. That's a dead end. This goes down, we have more down here. Oh, okay. I like to block these, though. I think that's safe. I don't know. <laughs> I, it, it's questionable. <laughs> what do we got? Some obsidian and a saddle. Nothing special okay. there. I like to just break chests, though. Um, that's my way. I don't know what your way is. Oh, just so you know you've been there. That, that I, makes sense. Yep. I, I break. Didn't, um, I didn't break an then, a, bring an axe, so if you have an axe, oh, go for it. <laughs> yeah, I have an axe. And I can always do with some obsidian because I don't really have any extra. Obsidian. I do have a blaze rod. If we want to head back up, we can always craft some fire resistance potions if we're worried about blazes. Because um, I do have the materials worried, for that. But... Okay, wow. This is kind of pretty. I like this. This is actually really pretty. And it kind of shows you like how big of, you know, like the fortress. Cool. All right. I'm going to do like one more. I know we're probably not going to come back down here. But... Yeah. <laughs> no, it's always smart because you never know. Because I just thought of this. We didn't like. Yeah, we should. We should do one oh, here. We got too. a blaze. I always, we got a blaze right there. I always do one here. Just because it's. Um... Oh, skeleton. I don't even have a shield. I came so unprepared. I oh, ouch! <laughs> I got my yeah. shield. <laughs> I yep, hear another I blaze. Like, I totally. I don't see him. I hear him. I also gotta try to not hit you on accident. So. Yeah, I know. Oh, we got the Kelly guys down here. Let's Ooh, pick a these blocks up that I left here. I grabbed four stacks. I should have plenty of netherrack. Okay, here, here comes some friends. Since you have the OP sword, I'm going to let you take them out. And the looting. The looting helps, too. Oh, yeah. I spent so long enchanting the sword and so many levels at the skeleton spawner. You have no idea. Okay, let's... 
So that's a dead end. So what I'm going to do is like that. Just so we know that doesn't go anywhere. Yeah. Okay. And actually, I'm going to place a couple torches so we know this is where we came in at. Kind of uh, yeah. to tell us our way back. Smart. Torches on the right. I don't know if that's the right way for you or not, but that's what I just did. <laughs> um, torches on the left, so it marks the right way out. Uh, I did it wrong. Yeah. Everyone <laughs> normally does because they don't really like the method. Did we go yes. up here yet? Um, so we have an I up and we have a down. And we have a blaze behind us. Oh, hey, um, I just kind of was doing cheaty boards or yep. cheaty things. Here is pretty much a dead end. Like This is definitely the problem with... So we can just block that, yeah. This is the problem with these fortresses is they're a maze. Like this will go up yeah. somewhere, this goes down. So we don't know which one leads to... They both could lead to more areas of the fortress. <laughs> right. You're just going to find yourself... We got guys and skellies. Oh. Buddy, got him. Got him. Well, this will help with my coal supplies. Oh, that These scared me guys a little. Scare me all the yeah, time. Yeah, that got me a little bit. Cause like I won't look around the corner. I just do the things, and then I do it. Like then I'll look. Ah. Hello! I just totally paused. <laughs> like, hello's gonna do anything. Oh, we got some diamond horse armor. I'm gonna take that. Nice. And this is like a dead end, so... I don't have an axe. <laughs> I do. I'm also a hoarder. I like the chest. I didn't think about bringing because I'm like, I don't need an axe in another fortress. I don't need a shovel in another fortress, so I left those behind. I only have an axe because I was cutting trees and stuff before this, so... A good strategy for these is to not bring stuff that you're afraid of losing in case you die. Oh, we didn't do this up though, nope, right? Nope, that's the next way. So I blocked okay. off, and I'll do this here as well. I'm just kind of, um, let's just do this. Like, just so we know that that doesn't lead More, uh, anywhere. anywhere. So I'm kind of like putting like a, a vertical pillar so we know that that doesn't go anywhere. We do have more. Another wart, and it's actually open on top, so that's weird. I have not ever seen. Oh, fortune. Yep, I got fortune. Oh, oh you have a skeleton. Oh. I did not see him. I almost hit you. When I went up there. <laughs> I always, I forgot, I was forgetting to fortune earlier, so. I'm always, a, I'm always worried to stand on that and mine it, because I'm worried it's just going to plummet, like there's going to be a hole under there. <laughs> oh really? You said this was open up top. I kind of want to pop my yeah, head up and see. It's. Um, we have an Enderman. Oh, okay, I know where we're at. This area is kind of fun. Uh, if you want to come up here for a minute. Mhm. Mm just oh, uh, of just walk over on that other side for a little bit. <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> You may want to come oh, back. is this your invisible? That is the invisible fire. Yep, it's still there, guys. Invisible fire oh my there. Gosh. <laughs> I I'm got gonna Sammy totally with die. it. Die. I hope not. Don't die. <laughs> um, this there is a path over here. I think. Did you already? Did you just make this bar here? I just put this up here. Yeah. Are you still just on up. fire? No. Oh, that's a messed up. That's Why, a. Does it uh, look like I am? Yeah, it's it shows that you're still on fire. Mm, nope. Oh, that's uh, possibly a, a bug with the actions and stuff back. That's funny. Uh, I'm going to re-log really quick just to clear that off of you for myself. Because <laughs> <laughs> that is going to be distracting. Yeah, you were just permanently on fire. Uh, okay, you're good now. <laughs> Skelly. Perfect. And, uh, thing Random lava. cursed lava. Yeah. Just, just a random lava blade. I, like I am still using my infinity bow in here, but I do have a mending bow, guys. I have both on my hotbar, so it's okay. Despite what Prowl and Wraith would tell you, it's okay. I use both, so... I 
I just haven't got any yet. The only thing with my Your my uh, my mending bow has flame on it. My infinity does not. Oh, but like I said, nothing gosh. flame doesn't do you any good in here because none of the mobs are gonna have some gold and an iron horse armor. None of the oh, mobs. You're gonna have to. You're gonna have to pick that up. I'm oh, full. I can get it. None of the mobs in the Nether Fortress can be set on fire. Blaze are immune to fire. Wither skeletons are immune to fire. Zombie piglins, which you shouldn't be hitting anyway, are immune to fire. The skeletons are the only things you can set on fire. So having a flame is not even that big of a deal. Flame so or fire So this is aspect. pretty much like a dead end, like part of the Nether Fortress because, oh my lord. Good, hi buddy. <laughs> I totally almost ran into him. He just wanted to give oh. you a hug. Oh my lord, there's another. Ah! We, got, we got him. Oh, look at that, wither skeleton, skull. Okay, let's put up. Oh. Those are going to be part of some Halloween decoration, I think. <sighs> I like only want another work. Oh my lord. Hello there. Oh, he's coming to me now. Hi, buddy. I like so. Don't worry, I distract. No, nope, now he's going back to you. Where'd he go? I don't know. Did he go back to you? No, oh. he's up there still. I see him. He lost. He lost interest real quick. Got him. Yeah. Gotta get rid of all yeah, these stone swords. Of, oh, hi, buddy. I'm out of blocks, so. Oh, that guy picked up the stone sword. Oh, funny. Oh, did you? I, I grabbed four stacks. Do you want some more? Yeah, I only grabbed two. I didn't know that it go. was gonna be this. In depth. Come on. Get You've been using. Room. Do you have a room? Oh, um, not really. Here, give me the gold because I've already got some gold on me. And if you have like blaze rods, I can take those. I don't have any blaze rods. Um, there's some ingots. Yep. We oh, can just we a... can just inventory consolidate. Boop. Boop. I have some stuff I can get rid of. There. Look at you being no. the responsible one. I was just throwing all the swords and junk on the ground. <laughs> um, that, that. Okay, let's block that. Just get rid of that one lonely guy. Do you want iron horse armor? Um. Or gold? I'll I'll take them. I don't know if I'll do anything with them, but I'll take them. Okay. Okay. I don't really have anything else to get rid of. We have a blaze coming up on us. Okay. Oh, he, that was close. Hi, buddy. I always plug this hole. I don't know if I'm the only one who does that. All right, these don't the go anywhere. I'm just going to block these like this because these are just dead ends. I mean, yeah, that works too. As well. What I'm doing is plucking these guys from a distance, but then I'm swapping to my looting sword before the arrow hits them. That way I get oh, the looting effect smart. still. Yeah, that's really smart. We should be coming up on a couple blaze spawners here Oops. pretty soon. Which I uh, see yeah, one right now. Right, right ahead of me, yeah. Can you get out of my face, dude? Oh my lord. Uh, I do have torches on me, so we can disable that spawner really quick. Oh, there's um, a... Back up. Yeah. There's a oh. there's a wither skeleton and blaze just spawned. Nice try, guys. Oh hi. Oh hello. hello. I should have kept my sharpness sword because it would still do good on these guys. Ouch! I'm on fire. Got him. Oh, that's a lot. Here, let me just bow these guys. And not hit Ow. him. Ow. Don't you just love that? I have five torches. Do we have to do, like, the specific pattern? Uh, on all sides. And, like, one gap away. Oh. This is what will completely block it. Really? Yep. If you have blocks, like light blocks, you can put it on all all five sides and it'll block it. Oh, I guess if you have torches, do, gap them one away. I do um, glowstone blocks here, there, and that corner, that corner, that corner, and then here, and then yeah. You need to make it so no area in the spawn range is below a light level, I think, of 11. Okay. 
Yay. Okay, so we have two ways we can go, it looks like. Um... I think this way goes much further into the fortress, so this one would probably be uh, more of a dead end. So we should probably go this way first. Let's do this way, yeah. I'm trying to remember. I did kind of scout this out in creative a little bit ahead of time, but not enough to like ruin oh, knowing is where totally... everything is. Um... Which, honestly, I recommend if you have the ability, testing a lot of stuff in creative beforehand. It helps remove some of the danger because the nether and these areas are a little terrifying sometimes. Right. I hate these things because you never know what's up there. Yeah, we have a zombie piglin up here and that's about it. Oh, okay. What we can do too is like on these landing platforms, put a couple torches. This will stop like wither skeletons from spawning right here. So when you come up these, you won't get ganked. Oh, really? I didn't know that. Yep, they are, they are light dependent. That... If you run around your fortress and just spam torches on all the paths, you, you can stop their spawns. Oh, there's Here a couple guys. Some... Ah! Sucks to be him. Whoopsie! <laughs> hey, buddy. Right here. Hi, he how just... are you? Oh, I was like, did he just get taken out? Oh, yeah, he did. The skeleton, not the wither skeleton. Yeah. Uh, we have a wither skelly boy right there and a blaze. All right. Got him. Where are you going? I do still have more blocks if you're, um... I'm getting kind of low. Oh, I got... Oh, he tried. He tried so hard to get in that gap that I almost didn't block in time. Um, I think we're reaching a dead end. Oh, back up, back up, back up. What? Oh, I'm not over there. Oh, he's trying to get... The, the Wither Skeleton sees this as, like, a valid place to get me. He's trying oh. to, like, come around. Uh, this is pretty much all dead end here, though. Yeah, we got some over here. I mean, this is a dead end, though. But, like, here, it looks like a dead end this way, too. And that goes back down. Is this where we I came up at? Blaze. Yeah, that's where we came up. I was hear there, a blaze, but I don't Was there see anything it. else up here? Not really. Where did we get? Oh, did we didn't go this way, did we? Um, I went one way and it just seemed like dead oh, end. There hear... was a, a skelly guy. I hear blazes too. I wonder if we're near a spawner, because that's a lot of blaze noises. Right, and then because like this is a dead end, but typically this marks a blaze spawner. I hear a lot of blazes. I think there's a spawner very close. Yep. Yeah. Uh, Sammy. There's our spawner. Oh. That is a good location, though. Because that's, like, completely buried. So it, like... Yeah. Well, it, there's got to be a staircase or something. Well, there is, but it looks like it just goes into a, um... Covered area. I'll let you... I, I didn't want to shoot him and, uh... <laughs> I'm in danger! You. Okay. I'm probably going to die. I'm three hearts. Oh, yeah, I'm dead. Oh, no, Sammy. <laughs> um, I knew I'd die sooner or later. Um, yeah, I just really care about my pickaxes. <laughs> Shoot. I, I'm going to try to keep shooting these guys from up here. Once I can take care. Because I don't oh, want to jump down there way. and have them fireball and then toast your equipment. Oh, I was in a puddle of fire. Oh, no. Uh, yeah, so all I really care about is my um, two pickaxes because I don't have an easy way to get fortune or silk touch right now. All right, I'm going to wait for one more spawn of that spawner. I'm going to take him out. I'm going to jump down there. And he shot me. I'm on fire. I hate fire. It's so annoying. This is why I was going to make... um. Fire yeah, resistance we, potions. We probably should have backed out, made the resistance and whatnot, but. Okay, I am. You have a big explosion down here. So that's oh, yeah, good. I, I see I of... see gear. Um, I have a lot of stuff on me. I'm going to start throwing stuff on the ground that I definitely don't need and try to start grabbing your equipment. Yeah. Uh, get Anything rid of that. diamond. Get rid of that. Get rid uh. of that. 
Get rid of that for right now. Get rid of that. Get rid of those extra arrows. Right, I'm gonna run, do a swoop, and try to grab your stuff. There is so much fire. Yeah. There oh, was like there ten more. up, ten blazes down there. Okay, I've got some stuff. Uh, you've got chests there. I'm gonna try to. Oh yeah, I, I had picked up all the chests from breaking them. Yep, I'm gonna try to grab those. So I got them, so I can. Put them down and throw your stuff in a chest. Do you have like any food in these chests? Oh yeah, four pork chops. That'll work. I have whatever I whatever I've picked up. I'm just gonna start. No, I'm at. I just totally took four ch pork chops from your chest by your portal. You're fine. Because I was hungry. Help yourself. <laughs> I have twelve of your steak. Okay, good. I'm trying to quickly throw. Everything here in chests. Okay. Or blaze. Let's see more. I think I have I got... no idea how I'm gonna find you. Okay, I think <laughs> I got everything. And I have no I have no like tools. Cause like that's literally all the tools I have. I will do is I will backtrack and come find you <laughs> and we'll pick back up when we get back together <laughs> one eternity later hey look we found a Sammy hello um yeah let's um figure out how we can get you down here Boop. how's that beautiful Does that work I think that works. Yes. I hope all your stuff is there. I grabbed everything that was splattered everywhere. Hey, at least you have a quick uh, path to the spawner now. Right. And I'm going to relog because you're on too. fire again. Oh. The weather skull is yours. Yeah, you I just I just I stuff. just started putting everything in there to make sure I was picking oh, up your stuff. Okay. So. Yes, I was just dumping everything to make sure I was able to pick your stuff up. That's a good idea. I've got um, oh, stone swords okay. to get rid of. Some yeah, because it's pointless to keep anything. And none of that actually made it oh. in, the, in the fire. Can you set a fire next to that fire? Do you have one of my pickaxes on you? I do not. Shoot. I lost, it. I lost my self-touch. Oh, no. That's the one I didn't want to That lose. was your diamond. And Force I lost armor. my sword, too. Is this is this 48 nether ward all there is? Uh, no, there's 64. You grabbed some of it. Okay, you grabbed some of it. Yeah. I hear a... Gilly boys. We can just leave the rest of this stuff in a chest, I think. I think that was your crafting table. Oh, yeah, it was. I did put a torch down here, so hopefully nothing should spawn. <sighs> oh, sorry about your pickaxe. You got your armor, which, for what it's worth. I can, I mean, I can get my silk touch back. It's just, it sucks because I love mining with silk touch, but <clears throat> it's fine. Oh, uh, have we already been down here? Um, if we were down here, we never went up. Because, because this is all blocked, right? We We did this, didn't we? Yeah. Yeah, because there's torches up here. Ah, so we just went in a big circle and didn't even realize it. Yeah, because, like, I don't remember seeing that. Um, so Blaze Spawner up there. At least we know spawner. this is, like, a quick way out. Yeah. Where so was it again? These places are oh, such wow, a maze. Oh, look up there. Up. So many blazes up there. Oh, up ahead? Yeah. I saw that. <laughs> I was getting ready to start taking aim. And missing horribly. Yeah, because here's the blaze spawner that we torched. I hit a piglin. I hit another piglin. <clears throat> I'm hitting all the piglins. Well, if you take them out pretty quickly, I don't think it matters. Yep. Got him. Okay, so yeah, those two blaze spawners are actually fairly close together. Mm-hmm. 
So that might be the majority of the fortress then. I think we've gotten the whole thing. Yeah, I am totally okay with calling it quits there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I might actually see how close they are because they might make a good double spawner farm. Oh, quit it. I hear more guys like up above somewhere, but. Well, there is some fortress blocks there. So. Yeah. And we didn't go through the whole thing because. Um... I think we got most of it though. Yeah. Because we've been all For through sure. here, so I think we kind of need to There's backtrack a little bit. There's a blaze. Hey, buddy. Ow, 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 ow. You still have my sword? No, I put it back. Okay. Because I didn't want to lose it. So is this where that one guy was trying to get you, though? Like the... I don't know. I don't remember now. I'm kind of... Oh, skeleton. <laughs> did you lose your sword, too? I did. Oh, yep. man. Socks. I, I'm going to throw another torch. I'm just going to kind of torch these little landing zones. So we don't get mobs when you're coming up the stairs. Yeah, I was just trying to find the, the fast way out. There's a blaze... Since I don't really have a sword, it's hard for me to take them out now. Yeah. Is it this way? Where was it? Oh yeah, it was right here. Okay, so the blaze thing room is here. This is where you mined out to get me. So we could go back up this All way. Alright, so if we hadn't we gone we hadn't gone these ways. Yeah. What happened here? What? Did, did oh, we... I dug it out. Oh, okay. I was, I was like, confused. I was hearing ouch i was hearing the um so then this would have been the only other way and this is a dead end so yeah that was the end of the fortress there wasn't anything else yeah unfortunately you you <laughs> didn't quite quite cross the finish line but <laughs> no nope, almost though i mean but hey at least I'll we have a win. we have a uh, express staircase here right to a blaze spawner that's very nice uh do you want to go see really quickly down this tunnel, the other one. Just pop your head in really quick and see what I'm going to have to deal with later. Sure. Oh, so God. this is the staircase I made. Uh, this is a little treacherous down here. I. You like a lot of staircases. Yeah, oh, I just like nothing to jump all the time. Oh my lord, this is like wide open. Yeah, this is like... And uh, there's... No. And piglins spawn in here. Is and a, a lot more gas. Right here too? That's a spawner. Unfortunately, the blades are still able to spawn, like, underneath this platform. <laughs> oh my lord. Yeah, because of the way this platform is set up, the blazes are spawning, like, underneath down there. Yep, nope. But do you see you the do you see the second spawner? Yeah, I do. It looks very close. They are, <laughs> like, two blocks too far apart. Oh, really? Oh, oh yeah, a blaze just, just, yep, it just spawned underneath us. And it's all above lava oceans. So Well, that's a good I mean, it's a good fortress for farms and stuff because you want it to be on lava oceans. It'll be interesting. I I'll do be de sorry. dealing with a lot more um gas fire yeah. and the open bridges uh, make it harder bringing... to block the wither skeletons a little bit. Yeah. I have not gone this is as far as I've gone in here, was just blocking the spawner and shooting some of the blaze. That's where those four blaze rods came from. Oh. <laughs> That's funny. And I was doing all the stairs on these to stop spawns, too, to make that spawn proof. <laughs> yeah, that will be my fortress when I decide to do, like, a blaze spawner, and if I want to farm crazy. up wither skulls. Yeah. And you already have one, so you're you only need two more. I don't think I'll be doing the wither anytime soon. That skull's probably going to become Halloween decoration for the <laughs> immediate time. <laughs> yeah. All right, let's oh, work our way. way back to the nether hub and see what we all got. Yeah. All right, so throw in everything that I picked up and everything I, I, I brought back. I brought back the uh, cauldron and the potions. We never ended up making this, but what we were going to do was use our water buckets and the cauldron 
and then fill up some water bottles, and we were going to make fire resistance potions. Had we done that, Sammy may not have met her untimely demise, unfortunately. So that all wasn't really part of our loot. And unfortunately, Sammy lost some of her stuff. I yeah, you've... just a sword and a pick. It's fine. I could use a stone sword until I have to. You can take all the quartz and... Because I got tons of quartz. I, look in um, this, oh, bottom, yeah, this bottom did. chest. <laughs> that was from mining these tunnels. So I think what we'll you do is we'll split the blaze and we'll split the uh, nether wart. Yeah. Eventually, I'll probably want more magma blocks. Uh, you can have the gold, too, if you want, because I think I have a bunch of gold. Yeah, I've got a ton of gold here. You can have... I don't know if you... If, did you lose the soul sand when you died? I did. If you need more soul I, sand, I there's a bunch here. I'm pretty <laughs> sure I have some. Did yeah. you take your blaze rods already? Yes. I took my oh, blaze okay. rods and my nether wart. So you should have 11 blaze rods and 56 nether wart. Yep. Uh, cool. Diamond horse armor. I think you lost the iron. That's okay. <laughs> the iron. This was all part of the cauldron that I never... Yep. The iron was going to be to repair my gear, but I already did that. The cauldron was going to be to make potions, which I'll probably set that up somewhere here in the nether just to like make potions on the fly i'll just leave these here for right now you can pretty much have what's left all right that sounds like a plan i really only wanted the nether wart so yeah it was a lot of fun agro yep. minus the death that was not fun <laughs> it shows everybody that even if you go in there pretty well prepared you still meet your untimely demise so don't bring in any equipment that you're worried about losing or that you can't yeah. replace easily sammy lost a good pickaxe but she thinks she can replace that pretty easily so it's not a huge it's not a detrimental loss to her <laughs> yeah it'll be the levels that is oh, the frustrating you probably wanted part, the chests but... so there you go oh yeah i love chests they're yeah, so the levels. Fun. Oh, you but, gotta get that villager trading done so you can get levels by trading with them. Right. So, alrighty, it's been fun, Agro. Awesome. Bye. All right, we'll see you later. Well, okay, that was a fun group collaborative project with Sammy, getting that Nether Fortress taken out. It's too bad that I couldn't keep her from burning to a crisp, but yeah, it happens. So we've got our chest of loot from the fortress here. We're probably, I think, a perfect thing to use this upstairs area for is going to be setting up our potions and our nether wart. So we'll do that at a later time because this episode is already going on long enough as it is. But I think we could set up like the nether wart soul sand on the walls maybe. I might use this little alcove in here for doing some potion stations. I think that'll be a good use for this area, but we did get some blaze rods. We'll definitely be going back at a later time to farm up some more blaze rods and set up a proper farm for them. And then eventually we'll get some more wither skeleton skulls because we'll, we'll eventually want some, uh, want to do a wither fight so we can get beacons around here. But that'll probably be something we do after we go to the end and we get the dragon and elytra and all that stuff. But I want to thank you guys for hanging out and watch our group collab project taken on the Nether Fortress. And if you would, please hit the like and subscribe button. It really helps out a lot. I'm trying to get the channel up to 500 subscribers and every single one of you helps me get there. So thank you all for hanging out and catching this episode of Surviving Bedrock. And my name is Agro and I got to skate later.